today is concrete day. Uh, it's 6 a.m. right now. Just waiting for everybody to arrive. We're actually, first thing to arrive is going to be the pump truck. He's going to get set up here over on the pad. Uh, we decided to go with a pump truck for the concrete for this, um, mainly due to just making the whole job easier in general. Um, it, it makes things go a lot quicker, a lot smoother. So um, the other thing was it rained a couple nights ago, and this entire area got super, super muddy. So I didn't want to risk having to drive uh, any of the trucks over here if we had to deal with that. It's been super dry the past couple days, so that's definitely not a problem now, but I'm um, still very glad I chose the pump truck. That way it'll just make the entire thing easier. So um, we got all of our equipment here that I picked up yesterday that we're renting. So we got four power trowels, um, a power screed, and then we, I went ahead and got pretty much an extra uh, trowel just in case something went wrong with one of the other ones. Um, and just make things go a little quicker. We got a hand screed here as well in case something happens with this. But uh, other than that, we're ready to rock and roll. So just waiting for everyone to start showing up and get everything set up. And the first truck, uh, concrete truck, will be here at 7.30. We got them spaced out a half hour each. And um, that's it. We're going to be a busy day. But uh, it's going to be a successful one. And it's going to be really cool to see this slab poured after all this work that we've been doing. So stay tuned. Well, we got it all done, all the concrete poured. Uh, I actually went ahead and pulled all the forms out. Uh, we made all our cuts. Uh, we had to break it up. We hid most of these cuts under the walls where we could. So that's gonna work out really good. Obviously there's some you can't avoid, uh, especially in the big gray area over here. So um, yeah, that's it. Everything went super successful. Very, very happy with the finish. It looks a lot um, powdery right now just because from all the cutting and we blew it off. It rained the other day. so. It's not what the finished look will look like, but that's it. Very, very happy with it. Um, again, I had an awesome crew that helped out. They really kicked butt. I mean, we finished this whole job, started at 7.30 in the morning, first truck arrived, and by 2.30, floor was finished, cleaning up tools. Um, everything went really, really great. Um, very happy with, with every part of it. Garage drain right here, everything sloped really perfect. Uh, it's an inch drop overall. That came out great. And like I said, it actually rained uh, really, really hard last night. So uh, it was nice because I was able to cool the slab off a little bit. And uh, I got to check out if every, all my drains worked. Um, obviously, the garage one here was coming out of the pipe over here. You can still see some standing water where that's draining. Um, so, yeah, that worked out really, really good. It's completely dry. There's no pooling or anything. A few little low spots here and there, as expected. Um, but not a big deal. These floor drains here worked very well as well, so um, that's it. We got a radiant tube sticking up here. That came out really nice and clean around everything. A lot of pipes to finish around, um, but like I said, everything came out really good. Very, very happy. Um, next, we'll basically be letting this sit for a few weeks, cure up, and then we're going to start framing. So um, a buddy of mine is going to be framing it with his crew. Um, I'll be helping out a little bit, but that's something I am subbing out. 
Um, the last few homes I've framed myself. It is a lot of work. This one's pretty big, so I'm going to let another crew take care of that. But um, stay tuned. We're obviously going to have tons of videos on that. Check out how we got to this point in all the other videos. Site work, uh, footer forms, plumbing, and now we're finished with concrete. So um, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't yet, and we'll see you guys on the next one.